Bonjour, welcome back to the channel. I've been walking around for the past five minutes trying to find a quiet spot to talk to you, but there's lots going on. Olaf is doing building works, so I'm just going to go inside because I would love to update you on a couple of things that we've been working on in the past few weeks. I fully understand that I share all kinds of things in my vlogs and ask you for your help, for example, for the windows here, and I don't always get back to what we chose or how, what we've done. And the reason that I don't show you what we've done is because if I don't show you, then we probably haven't done anything, <laughs> which is the case here. We did decide that we can't do internal shutters. There is not enough space. We've looked into shutters on the exterior. And then uh, we also found these, uh, it's called a paravent in French. It's just shutters that you put on the floor inside of the, the room. And then you can just fold them out. And that seems to be the best option. We don't use curtains here. We currently live in this space. We're not bothered. We know nobody's ever passing in front of the street. So we will not be buying that until this will be rented out, which will be in 2023. And then many of you have asked to show the house, like do a full house tour. There's just not so, not so much to show. I did this little uh, makeover of the guest room. That is in the old part of our house. It's in the middle of building works. So I will do all of that when it's finished. And I do understand why people want a full house tour because I think you're getting kind of lost with everything that we're sharing. So let me explain. That is the cabin. It is on the edge of our property. Well, there's a whole farm field behind, but that is a cabin. It's separate from our house. Here is our garden with the swimming pool. And then here is the big house. So let me turn the camera so you can understand. This is what they call a longère in French, a typical farmhouse for this region. There, where it's all closed, that is where the farmer and their family lived. It's a small room with a fireplace, everything they needed to cook, be warm, eat, and everything else and sleep, but usually all in the same room. This part of the house is the barn. So that's why you have the big opening. So all of the tools they needed to work in the fields could be stored there. This is where the stables were. So that window obviously wasn't there. The door was maybe this high, still held the troughs and everything when we started cleaning up and created that uh, house to live in. And the reason we did that, because we wanted to just renovate this part of the house, but then the architect said, where are you going to live? Because we had already decided to move here permanently. So we decided to turn the stables into a small house. Well, it isn't small, it didn't turn out small. And now we're doing the build for the kitchen and when that's finished, we'll renovate the old living space. Old part of the house, future kitchen, former barn, current living space, former stables. And this last summer, like in 2021, was maybe for about two, three months, my Brocant shop. So I hope now you have a better feel for where everything is. The boys, as we call our professional builders, have come back. Uh, to do some important structural work. We've had one of Olaf's viewers come from his YouTube channel and help us out. So install the window and the door. Flexen. Oh, even spieren, even. <laughs> Basically, we're waiting for the huge window to be um, installed and we're waiting for that to be finished um, from the factory. So that might be end of November, maybe around Christmas. The professional builders have prepared the entire wall and opening for the window to go in. So they've reinforced the structure. And here's an update on the inside. So they have made an opening all the way up on the first floor, going into a future studio music room for Olaf. Here is another opening going into the living room of the oldest part of the house, currently storage. And here you can see this big opening where the big window will be. This used to be the barn, and we're turning this into our big kitchen. This is the future kitchen window, and Olaf and Patrick placed it all the way back. It was all the way to the front, and it couldn't fit my sink underneath. Now it can. And the rest of the kitchen will be in an L shape following the walls. It will also have a big kitchen island. 
and we will also have a wood-fired stove here and then through that opening doorway there is our storage room do know that whenever i do have things to show you i will really um my life this is what it's like someone said you know it, it was a bit of a messy vlog well this is my life i juggle a lot of things at the same time so in this vlog it's just going to be what i've been up to in the past weeks it was halloween that was yesterday and it was amazing how gorgeous the weather was it's just so warm we're still out like in in shirts and tank tops and shorts uh, so that was a bit of a strange experience um, and this year the boys didn't want to join they had so much more fun preparing a scary scene for when the children come to the door just going to give you a little slice of my life and a little slice of life in the French countryside in a very sunny fall season. This is our friend's house and I definitely need to do a house tour here very soon and I will because they already said yes. Do you know where you're cutting or do you want me to cut? You cut? Are you suggesting I'm cutting so yep. in case it goes wrong it's my fault? Yep. yep. Oh, Milo's picked up that knife. I, uh, you know. I say this, you need to cut it here. Because yeah, then these go in there. This. How much was it? What's the damage? <laughs> I don't have any insurance. <laughs> Shut up. It was, oh, it wasn't, it wasn't that much. Do you have like a proper knife? No. A guitar is what it's called in French. Like a cutter, but then <laughs> pronounced horribly wrong. Will it go? Will it or not? Yeah, look, see? Oh, you're actually cutting not straight. <laughs> yeah. This is why it probably why it needs to be on a oh, stable yeah. surface. <laughs> you think? Now it's so not level that it's no way of getting it in. <laughs> there we go! 
And then you oh. open it. Is this where you would open it every day? Oh, yep. No, it doesn't look like it. I think one needs to just stay put and the other one is not supposed to be sticking. Yay. There you go. Woo! Okay, let's, oh, well, let's get some compost to put in. There she comes. This is all for <laughs> the future vlog you're the, making. The premiere donation. See, the dogs are applauding you. <laughs> I thought I had so much. <laughs> and Might be a bit stuck, but uh, and then there's more here. There's one here. Another one? I'd like to keep one. Please. Yeah, you have to because they're such an original feature. Of, yeah. Exactly. Look. Oh, with this light, that is so gorgeous. I think. Yeah. Yeah. It's moving a little bit. It's not 